Hello ladies, Penny here. I've been doing a little bit of dress form, nothing as adventurous as Scrimping Mummy or Angela Holt or even our friend Fiona. Fiona started me off because um, I'd seen a little st a stuffed one she'd done. Um, well, it was a bit bigger than this one, but I liked it, so I thought I'd give it a try. So I did like Fiona. I made a body and then stuffed it and then covered her in some um, cheesecloth. She's got a petticoat on with two rows of lace. And then another slip on with um, some of that lovely lace. I think Fiona's has given me that. And, and then some pretty dress lace on top. I'm sorry I'm struggling a bit because um, Alf is not able to help me tonight. And when I did all that, I thought she deserved another skirt, so I did another overlay skirt like that at the back she's laced up and buttoned up and I put a little pink belt with tiny little daisies around she's got a little daisy um, a little daisy a little flower on her breast breast there and down the center I don't know if you can see it's like it looks like it's a frilly shirt down the side to match her uh, cuffs of her sleeves, which has also got little pearls um, attached to her. If I could stand her up again, I did like a Chatelet, uh, maybe that's a smelly pomodoro thing, and she's got her her dance card as well there. Um, and this side, of course, she's got her mini mini fan I knew I'd find a home for it one day that little tiny one all in all though I'm quite and I put um, little pearls around the edge and all in all I'm quite happy with that I do it small then I can only make small mistakes <laughs> and then I was watching Angela Holt and she was doing her Barbie dolls so I thought, well, I'll paper mache one as well. So I did. And um, this is my result from that one. Because the body only comes to there. And in the pink, I stuffed her. And I tried to do one of those dresses. She won't stand up, I'm afraid. I've got nothing to put in her at the moment. I put a, There's a yogurt thing there for the other one. <laughs> Um, hold on, there we go. So I've done her dress as a diagonal, and that was a bit awkward to do, but I managed. And then I put diamantes around and flowers at the corner, and then gave her like a fishtail at the back because she needed something with, um, with it going at a diagonal like that, and a tiny little flower at the back. And that's her bodice. And then she's got something for when she gets her head. She's got a little headdress there. I might make this into a stick pin holder. I'm not sure. I've just stuffed some black material in her at the moment. But I'm quite pleased. This one, the next one, oh, the way she gone. Here she is. Um, I did a summer dress. Oh, it is awkward with one hand. Um, I found this material and of course I'm no seamstress believe me it took me a whole term to do an apron at school so I opted out and did art but this one I had to put panels in for it to flare out a bit I put little roses round her waist a tiny little collar I find it a bit awkward what to do with the arms when they haven't got any like you know how to finish it off neatly at the top um, a little lace belt with tiny little 
um, gems and I don't know if you've noticed but I have managed to do a little pocket with a little flower there and round the back she's got some dynampi uh, dan little pearl buttons and the ties of her belt coming down to a nice lace trim at the bottom. I do like this one, maybe it's the material I like. So I've just got to work out how to stand them up now with some wire in that. But I like them, but it took a while to do the paper mashy and in fact this one's a bit too it could push a tummy in. It's a little bit too thin and I, I should have took longer on it. But it's worked, so that's the main thing. So that's my latest three three bits of work. So I hope Angela can see that I have I have tried to do one. And I, I think I'll be doing some more. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Bye. And craft when you can.